What's going on you guys? How's it going this morning? It's Dave here. It's David here. It's 8.30 in the a.m. It is 8.30. I am just hanging out. Kids all got out of here. And, you know, I'm just kind of hanging out. Getting the morning started. I was so tired this morning. I fell asleep at like midnight, right? <clears throat> and then I came to at about uh, four or so give or take and kind of almost fell asleep you know several times but noise kept keeping me awake whether it was a TV upstairs or somebody cooking or whatever so I just stayed awake and hung out and I'm just waiting for, you know, the day to kind of start. And I don't mean, like, I know that I have so many minutes in every day, right? So I'm not, like, sitting around waiting for something to happen. I'm just waiting for people to get up, wake up, just kind of, sorry, hang out. Avalon wants a guitar. He's wanted one for a while. And I think I'm going to be able to put one together for this evening. I hope. I also want to get her a... <clears throat> what was that system called? A chord buddy or something like that? It's like a, a guitar learning tool. thought she would enjoy it. But anyway. I just wanted to come this morning and kind of chit chat just because I was so. It's been a long morning already. Sorry. It's been a long morning already. Trying to. Trying to make it. <laughs> but. Now I just want to go from that to what I'm doing now, sitting in front of you guys, chit chatting with myself and with you lovely people. Thank you very much for joining me for that. <laughs> Pardon me, I'm so tired. Anyhow, <clears throat> it is it is Friday. Okay, tomorrow I should get the thing I ordered, and it says they sent me a tracking number, and the email says it should be here Saturday for the NBP four mod pretty stoked about getting that because I like really like the airflow of this TFV8 I like using it because the airflow is massive and speaking of massive airflow I, need to, I don't know what is wrong with this thing I've got this thing turned down to 20 okay I'll just take it up to 30 I turned it down to 20.5 watts at some point. Okay, now it's locked in. Sorry. When I'm, <clears throat> yeah. I guess that's why it's turned down. When I'm running higher wattages in sub ohm tanks, if you guys have vaped, you know this. It kind of spits at you when it gets too hot, right? Like it burns and crackles, I guess is what I'll call it. And then you, it'll shoot up into your mouth. Sometimes. So, I'm, that's why I turned it down on accident. But, this tank is not horrible. This is the sub tank mini by King Attack. It's a decent tank, but the other one, if you look, I'm just gonna show it to you. I'm sure you guys have seen it before. 
the other one has massive airflow even in the drip tip, right? So this one is restricted by the drip tip. How much airflow you're getting is restricted by the drip tip. The other one, or the other tank that I have, the TFD8, is not that way. So I don't know what I'm gonna. I'm sure I'll figure out something to do. Maybe I'll just go buy a different drip tip. A curved one, you know. I've seen those. But I have to pulse this oh, this button with this tank because it spits so, so much. And that's only at 28 watts. I just turned it up to 28 watts. But otherwise, I won't get any vapor. It won't produce any vapor because it's too cold, right? I don't know. I don't know why I'm sitting here just randomly just ranting. My daughter asked me last night if she could go somewhere, and I said yes. She wants to go to Texas for, I don't know if it's spring break or summer. I think it's spring break. Maybe I'm tripping, but she wants to go to Texas, and I don't feel very good about it. Not because I, you know, I just, I'll be so far away from her, you know, and as a dad, I've, I've lulled myself into this false sense of security, like I could do something about it, right, if something was to happen with her, but in reality, she's going to be a woman in a couple, you know, a year or two, this morning, I was kind of really thinking about it. Maybe it was last night. I don't remember. I was thinking about it, and I was, you know, just just know that anytime you need something, just give me a call, honey. Those kind of words were coming out of my mouth. And she goes, Dad, I don't know if you know this. Or not. Oh, that's what I said. I'm sorry. I got to go back. Why do you need me to stay, Dad? I said, that's not what I said at all. I said, I'm going to let you go. It's just hard for me to let you go. Why? Honey, I've only got, you know, I might have till tomorrow to see you, right? I don't want to share this time with anybody. I don't want to give you away for an hour, much less a week or two weeks or however long, I don't remember. I want you for myself. And I'm not saying that I'm giving up. I'm saying that if I don't, die soon regardless you're still gonna want to leave she goes I'm not leaving for years dad and I was like all right say that again when I'm recording this I'm gonna hold you to this honey she's like okay of course I didn't really record it I don't want to I mean I'm okay if my daughter does live with me but I would prefer her get out and become a young lady and come into adulthood, right? But anyways, I just wanted to chat. Thank you guys for listening. Like, comment, subscribe if any of those are applicable. Make sure you guys go to bed today. Better every day. Sorry, I just fell. Just make every day a little bit better. Just a little bit. And it's not that hard day to do either. If you really, every day, think about it. It's not hard to do. Just Make every day better, better every day, and smile as much as you can, possibly can. I love you guys, and have an amazing day. Thank you guys for watching.